Your vehicle may be equipped with our state-of-the-art blind spot monitoring system. Blind spot monitoring, or BSM, uses two radar-based sensors located inside the rear bumper fascia. The system monitors vehicles that enter the blind spot zones from the rear, front, or side of your vehicle. When the vehicle is started, the BSM warning light will be momentarily illuminated in both outside rearview mirrors to let you know that the system is operational. The BSM detection zone covers approximately one lane on both sides of the vehicle. The zone starts at the outside rearview mirror and extends approximately 20 feet or 6 meters to the rear of the vehicle. The system begins monitoring the detection zones on both sides of the vehicle when your vehicle speed has reached approximately 6 miles per hour or 10 kilometers per hour or higher. The BSM system notifies you of objects in the detection zones by illuminating the BSM warning light located in the outside mirrors. The system monitors the detection zone from three different entry points. It monitors the side, rear, and front. The system will issue an alert if a vehicle moves into your adjacent lanes from either side of the vehicle. Or if a vehicle comes up from behind your vehicle on either side and enters the rear detection zone with a relative speed of less than 30 miles per hour or 48 kilometers per hour. In any of these situations, the warning light will be illuminated. If the difference in speed between the two vehicles is greater than 10 miles per hour or 16 kilometers per hour, the warning light will not illuminate. If you use your turn signal in a direction the system senses a vehicle in the detection zone, an audible warning will sound as well. Remember though, the area on the rear fascia where the radar sensors are located must remain free of snow, ice and dirt or road contamination so that the system can function properly. Do not block the area of the rear fascia where the radar sensors are located with foreign objects like bumper stickers or bicycle racks. Please refer to the instruction manuals on the Owner's Information DVD or jeep.com owners for complete details and other important safety information.